Bruce Lee is the king of fancy kung fu footwork and an inspiration to millions of fans. Also known as the Dragon, Bruce only had 20 fight scenes filmed due to his early death. But each scene showcased his martial art talents in a different light. Here are 10 of the most intense fight scenes starring the famous legend. At number 10, Bob Wall in The Way of the Dragon. Bruce Lee takes on Bob Wall in an iconic fight, matching big kicks with graceful moves. Wall notably remained sore for a few days after this fight because Lee didn't believe he could fake a hit. At number 9 is the Big Boss in The Big Boss, fighting with two knives. Lee takes advantage of this by throwing one knife directly into Big Boss's stomach. It is the next move, however, that steals the show. Lee then stabs the man in his chest with his fingers. That is eight fingers going into Big Boss's chest, after which his face takes a beating until he's dead. At number 8 is Mantis, Kareem Abdul-Jabbar in The Game of Death. Towering at 7 feet tall, Kareem seems to have an easy advantage against 5'7 Bruce Lee. Lee struggles only to realize his shorter stature makes it easy to nail Kareem in the balls. Eventually, Lee finds light is the main weakness and uses that to win the battle. Number 7, Yoshida in The Chinese Connection. When Lee's character finds out it was Yoshida who killed his master, a fight ensues. Lee goes to the dojo and faces a samurai sword with only his hands. It isn't just the fight that makes this one of Lee's best, but the acting he does as well, ensuring to add small pauses between moves. At number 6, the double nunchaku, the way of the dragon. In his second fight scene with the Italian mob, Lee brings it home with two nunchaku. While handling this feat, Lee stays in character the entire scene by adding humor and jokes. Number 5, the fights against the underground drug lab in Enter the Dragon. Arguably the most notorious fight scene, Lee has to break free when his identity is compromised. He fights a number of henchmen with the camera always focusing on his precise martial arts movements. Lee ends the fight with a stick, batons, and his nunchaku. <laughs> Number 4, Danny and Santo in The Game of Death. This fight scene starts with batons and bamboo sticks, but quickly elevates into one of the greatest nunchaku battles yet. Both in Santo and Lee show off their weaponry skills with facial expressions to boot. It ends when in Santo takes a nunchaku to the neck. At number three on our list is Petrov in The Chinese Connection. As the world's strongest man, Petrov looks terrifying. Lee, however, is much more agile and soon runs circles around Petrov. When Lee gets stuck in an arm hold, he turns to his teeth and bites Petrov to get free. He then ends the fight by chopping Petrov's throat. Number two, it's Chuck Norris in The Way of the Dragon, one of the greatest fight scenes ever filmed. Bruce Lee and Chuck Norris battle it out in complete silence. Shot in the Coliseum, the two masters fight with both grace and respect only seen in the martial arts field. Lee's character uses the Ollie Shuffle and offers his opponent an opportunity to surrender before breaking his neck. Yeah. 
Then at number one, we've got the Japanese dojo in the Chinese connection. After the Japanese dojo disrespected his master's funeral, Lee enters their building to take on their entire group. This scene introduces Lee's impeccable nunchaku skills, as well as his many other fight abilities. This is also the fight scene that made Bruce Lee a legend and household name. What's your favorite Bruce Lee movie? Let us know in the comments below.